Yeah, hello again everybody and welcome back to Fujit's Blitz. So earlier I uploaded my very first modeling video and people have said, what are you going to do next? Are you going to do another one? And I'm going to do this, a Ferdinand. So this is what the real tank is. This was a tank captured by the Soviets in the Battle of Kursk. And they got it and they dragged it off and now it's in their museum in Kubinka. And I've been to Kubinka. And I've got quite a lot of pictures of the tank in there's the tank there. And that's not the original camo scheme, but it's near as damn it. But it's a good reference source. So I managed to get my hands on a Zevda model of this tank. There it is. It's Zevda's a Russian manufacturer. I've never made a Zevda model before, so it'll be a learning curve for me. I also managed to get my paws on to some photo etch from Edward. And there it is. So this will be my next project once I've finished the Matilda. Why have I gone down this road? Well, I'll tell you why. Because I've recently finished an SDKFZ251. This is it there. And my entire plan was to stick this on a Kursk type diorama. Now, this is based off a, a, a half track that was used by the German military at Kursk, which is why it's got that two tone rather than three tone camo. It belongs to the Wehrmacht because whilst the SS were at Kursk, they weren't with the Ferdinand Battalion. So this is based on a proper Wehrmacht unit that was with the Ferdinands in Kursk. As you can see, it, it's not finished this one, but it's near as damn it. There's still a few little bits and bobs to do, um, but it's on hold. It's on hold because I was waiting for the, the Ferdinand photo etch to come. Now, what I intend to do is a little diorama with this and the Ferdinand sort of parked, ready for action prior to the battle at Kursk, not during the battle or after the battle. And I'm going to have a couple of soldiers on here as well and a few guys hanging around the Ferdinand. I'm going to have this guy, he's going to be shaving off this thing. That's his jacket I've sort of made out of uh, putty there and I'm going to have a mate of his. So that's the next video guys. This is only a short one just to tell you what the update's going to be. Hopefully it's be, going to be something that's going to interest you. If, of course, these modelling videos are going to be interesting to anybody. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. Uh, hopefully I'll, uh, you'll tune in for the next one. There will be another Matilda video coming, but it's going to take about a week. And that'll be basically the pin washes and everything like that. So until the next time, guys, thank you, Zane, for popping by. Bye for now.